Hi everyone, welcome to Excel Magic Trick. Today we are doing the sparkline. So, what is sparkline and why we use a sparkline in Excel? A sparkline is a 10 chart in worksheet cell that provides a visual representation of data. Use a sparkline to show a trends in a series of values such as a seasonal increases or decreases economic cycles or to highlight maximum and the minimum values so let's see few example of this spark lines here so this is my excel data so i have a jan to december sale from 2001 to 2005 so now i'm looking for one uh, chart one spark lines data here in the next cell okay so uh, whenever you need you are putting you are creating these spark lines, you need to select a data. Right? So I selected data, then go to the insert. In the insert, we have that option, uh, we have a line, column, and windows in the spark line. So I selected first line. Okay. So uh, the first data range is selected. Now you have to uh, select here the location range where, where you need to put these spark lines. Okay. So I am selecting this column next to the my data then ok. Now see here one data trend line is here ok. So if my data is increased let's suppose 2001 in my data is lower in 2002 in my data is increased. So according to data the trend line is, uh, is going up ok and according to that it is going low. So let's suppose I'm putting here seven thousand. Now see here, your all data will be lower, and the last one is going on higher. Okay. So next one more spark lines I'm putting here. Next is insert. Then spark lines. I'm, again I'm putting the lines here. Okay. My location range is next one. Uh, for let's suppose if I'm looking for the high point, what is my high point? You need uh, go to the Sparkline tools and you, you will see here Sparkline tools. In the Sparkline tools, we have a uh, few options high point, low point, negative point, first point, last point, and the markers. So I uh, selected the high point. Now they will show the uh, whatever the high point. Let's suppose 750 is a higher one in the gen. In fact, we have the second uh, is a higher 889. Okay, they selected the, uh, they are showing the, uh, the marker on that particular point. Okay, let's suppose if you want to show the low point, what is a low point? Now I am selecting only the low point. This is my low point. Negative point, negative point we don't have because uh, our value is not negative. First point, last point. If you want to show the first point and last point, you can show uh, from here. And also we have the markers. Markers are the all uh, the point have the uh, marker. Okay, uh, point value, point uh, in there. Next is so again I'm selecting the data. Then spark lines. This spark lines. Uh, sorry, I'm doing the column. I'm creating the column one in the next one. Okay, I selected the column. Then I selected the range. Now see here we have the column data. Let's suppose in the first we have a smaller, in the uh, second one we have a 73 higher, 491, 93, and 314. It's also the dynamic one. If if you change the value according to the data, they will be right. go to increase or decrease. Okay. Next is Will loss. So will loss will be not work here because will loss uh, will work for the negative point. Okay. So if you have the uh, negative value and the positive value, you can show with the uh, will loss. Okay. If you want to show the uh, high point, you can show from the here. Now see here the high point will be red. Okay. If you want to show the low point, I suppose I am saying I want to show my data in low point. You can show with the, the red one is a low point. So this is sparklines is very useful in Excel and dashboard. Thank you guys.